Hi, my name is Archo, and we are going to do lessons of how to draw a monster's head. So, the first step is to rough out your monster. Make sure you do it in shapes like this. You want to make a circle for its head because you don't know what shape it'll be. So start out by roughing a circle out. Now, I'm going to draw a different one than you, maybe, because maybe you want to do something different. Well, it just so happens that a circle is not going to be your whole monster. Maybe you want a beard for it or something else. Make sure you draw that in a triangle beard. So, I'm not going to draw a beard for it, so we'll just ignore that line. So, what I am going to do is, you see how many lines there are inside the circle? I'm going to erase them. Because we only need lots of an outline. Like this. Okay, it looks a lot better, right? So, we've been going on and talking about a head, right? You want to make some other details, like if it were an oval, you want to make it kind of more ovally like Well, I'm making my not an oval, but kind of a rounded egg sort of thing. Like this. Well, it might not look perfect, but we can rough it out to be perfect. So, you see this extra line down here? I'm going to erase it. Because we don't need it. We already know that we already have our basing outline. And here's a trick. When you erase, try to keep it so the lines are still there. And you see what ha just happened? Those, the lines that are important got erased. So try not to do that. Well, you see how I'm drawing an egg-like shape? So, you see how I'm drawing an egg-like shape? Yep, you saw that, right? Yeah. So, you see there's all these extra lines right there? We're going to erase those too. Okay. Well, that's good enough for now, right? If you want to give him some hair, then go ahead. But remember, he's a monster, so we want to make him look a little scary. So I'm giving my monster hair. Like that. He's going to be kind of like a wisp creature. So, one of might shade the outsides of him. And make sure you leave room in the middle. So you, so you have room for the mouth and eyes. So, I'm just going to draw the eyes. How do you like that? Well, I'm not done with my monster because I want to make some teeth. Well, if you want to make teeth, then go ahead and shade in the rest because you already make a, a dark outline for your teeth. But let's say... Your monster doesn't have a mouth, but you want it to have a mouth, and you want it to stay covered up. Then, what you might want to do is go like this. Like that. That'll make it look like it might have a mouth, but it's too camouflaged to see it. But I want mine to be like this. So, it's a vampire wisp. Looks pretty scary, huh? Well, we're not done with it. I have some special pens I want to show you. Okay? So, we're done with this, and let's keep moving on. Just sorry, I need to adjust this a little more so we can see more. Good. Oh, way too close. That's okay. Boing, boing, boing. Okay. So, ready to come back? Good. I'm going to show you some of my cool pens now. Well, just so happens that there is a little pen that we call SC. So, I just want to shade this in, this hair in, and 
for his other details, we might want to have a little more thinner. And I got just the right thing. So, we got what we needed, right? Let's finish doing the hair. And then, let's keep it like this. Looks pretty neat, huh? Might want to add some ears, too. So, if you think you forgot any details, be sure to keep them in with your um pen. Like that. Now he looks more elf-like. He's not a wisp anymore. Maybe he's not a wisp. I changed my mind. You can always change your mind all along the way. Now, you see these are some hard details to, to shade? Look what would happen. I would shade the whole thing. If I use SC, now we're going to use M. It's kind of like a ballpoint pen. Okay, so get ready. Trace the eyes. Notice how it makes the line thicker, but doesn't color it in all the way. Okay, so now I'm going to do the last part of him. Like that. And make sure you want to color in the shading. Like that. So, looks pretty cool, doesn't he? Well... That's not it. I'm going to erase this. And we're almost done. Make sure to erase it once you're done with the pencil. And we've got him. Now, this doesn't look very detailed, right? We're going to use our M to get it detailed. <laughs> We're going to get him detailed. I have a little song about that. If you want to make him really scary, color around his eyes. Now we'll make him look scary. Maybe not to you, but maybe to other people. Na 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 na. Okay, looks pretty scary, doesn't he? And we are finished. Make sure to come for the next episode, whoever watching this.